Spoiler alert, there's a bit of a rant ahead. I recently received a LinkedIn connection request from someone I had never heard of that launched straight into a sales pitch and I bet you've received something similar. If you're like me, in 99.9% .9 of all cases, I hit the ignore button. And guess what? The same is true with your leads and customers. And it's not just limited to LinkedIn. Going straight for the sale without nurturing your potential customer is like asking someone to marry you on the first date. It's never going to happen. Lead nurturing is the building of relationships with individuals who are not currently ready to buy but could be an ideal customer in the future. You need to be able to impress your customers, delight them and show them you value them before you ask for the sale. So how do you do that? Well, here are five things you might want to consider using to nurture your leads more effectively. Number one, use multiple channels. Reach and nurture your audience where they are, on multiple channels, rather than just email. Make sure your sales and marketing team is aligned. Align your sales and marketing team to improve your lead nurturing tactics and boost customer retention. Number three, use lead scoring. Implement a lead scoring strategy to help you determine which leads you should focus your time on. Number four, send timely follow-ups. Follow up your leads in a timely manner to keep them engaged and interested, as well as to keep your brand top of mind. And last but not least, personalise your communication. Personalise your emails where possible with their name and interests in order to promote customer retention and improve the customer experience. So are you already using some of these tactics? And if so, which ones are working best for you? Let me know in the comments.